Hey y'all, welcome or welcome back to another video. My name is LaDracia. This is my channel, Life as LaDracia, where I share my life experiences with you. In today's video, I'm gonna be giving you guys the full rundown on the Marc Jacobs tote bag. I'm gonna let you guys know if it's worth the price, how the material holds up, what fits inside of the bag, and if I think it's worth purchasing. So I'm gonna let you guys know straight away, I absolutely love this bag. It was worth every penny. The mini size currently retails for $175. The medium retails for $185. The large retails for $225. I have it in the medium. I purchased mine from the Nordstrom in the Galleria Mall in Houston. As far as I know, you can currently purchase the bag on Amazon, Nordstrom, as well as Marc Jacobs directly. I feel like the small size is cute. However, I don't think that it could carry that much. And I also feel like the large is a little too big. It's more so for travel. However, the medium size is perfect. I have used this bag for work. I've used this bag for travel. I've used it for college and it fits a lot. Now, some things that I dislike about the bag, which is not many would be the fact that the bag picks up on lint like crazy but that's nothing that a lint roller can't fix as you can see the bag is like a thick linen cloth material it picks up on dust and lint pretty easily i have to be careful to make sure that i don't have anything on my hands or makeup or anything like that especially if i'm going to be wearing it as a tote rather than over the shoulder or a crossbody because i don't want to transfer transfer marks and things like that onto the bag so let me give you a quick overview of the bag again this is what it looks like this is the front of the bag and this is the back it comes with the two top handles. It also has this cute little side handle design. The bag comes with one main zipper compartment. And when I tell you guys there is so much space on the inside of this bag, like so, so, so much space. The side here, it does come with another pretty large zipper compartment that could hold a lot of things. I normally keep my AirPods, lip gloss, and my wallet in these compartments here. I keep my things pretty organized, but if you're a person that just likes to throw stuff in the bag, just throw it in the bag, then I highly recommend you purchase a bag organizer. The bag also comes with this black strap. The strap is super easy to attach. You just clip it onto one side, clip the other one to the other side. Super simple. Most days, this is how I wear the bag. I just put the strap on my shoulder and let the actual bag hang on my side. Lastly, I want to show you guys what I actually keep inside of my bag just to give you a better idea of how much this bag can actually hold. So first up is going to be my MacBook Pro. This is the 13 inch. As you can see, it fits in the bag. No problem. It doesn't protrude out on the sides. Fits perfectly. Next up is going to be my iPad. Fits in perfectly. Does not protrude the bag on the sides. And I still have plenty of space my headphones, my makeup slash toiletry bag that I take with me everywhere, manicure kit, lotion, sunglasses, AirPods, card holder, my charger, hand sanitizer, and lastly, some water. I was able to fit all of that in my bag perfectly fine. Everything is nice and organized. I don't have to scramble through my bag to try to find what I'm looking for. I'm still able to zip my bag completely perfectly fine and I'm ready to go for the day with all of my everyday essentials. So if you were thinking about purchasing the Marc Jacobs tote bag, like I highly, highly recommend it. I feel like the bag is going to last you. It's very durable. It's good for everyday use, for travel, if you're in school. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already. I promise you're gonna love it here. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.